Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, Prodigy's Mind here today, and really quickly, I wanted to do a quick Persia update video, or, well, I just said Persia, it's actually uh, Asteria now. Um, don't ask about that, because I disagree, and I don't like the name change, but we have changed our name to Asteria, so we're now in the United States of Asteria, which is cool, I think, maybe. Anyway... A uh, quick update, because our IP has changed again, we've changed hosts again, and we could possibly change again here within the next few months. It's kind of up in the air right now, so sorry about that. Um, we did get our host dropped us, just straight up dropped us, like, with no heads up or anything, which really pissed me off, but that happened, so whatever. And so yeah, we have a new IP, and we also have a new world. Now, I'm in spawn right now, this is new spawn, there's lots of new stuff coming in, guys, it's really neat. You should really come on and check it out. The IP is 192.99.21.76.39743. It'll be in the description down below. You don't have to memorize that or anything, but, you know, I figured I'd throw it out there. Now, really quick, um, I'm going to run to Newport here in a second, but I do want to show off real quick. This is a project that me and uh, Blib did a few days ago. Um... Some of you who are more familiar with the server might know that the Brooklyn Bridge was once it was at one point really, really small. I mean, it was like really small. Uh, it ended about here. Uh, now you can see that's the middle. We, me and Blue, restrung the bridge. We extended it by a ton, and got a lot of work done, which is awesome. And as you can see, this river has been widened, and there is no water here anymore. Um, don't worry about that. There will be water again. Um, but we are working on terraforming the river. Because uh, we did get a new world, and we pasted it in NSP, and so we have to kind of fix all the bits. Wow, Jig, okay. Um, yeah, let me just... Yeah, nobody saw that, okay. Um, yeah, so we are working on kind of getting NSP situated on this new map. So I'm going to run real quick to... Oh, it's gone now. Well, I can get that pretty quick. It's north. Dude. So let me fly to Newport. Now, Newport actually isn't new at all. Newport is kind of old port now. Um, but in Newport, as you can see there, we do have the USS Intrepid, which I think has been getting some updates, maybe. I don't know. They've been working in this area. I know they're, they're working on terraforming. This looks a bit odd right now. Uh, hopefully, I'm sure that'll get situated over the next couple days. Also, this is Newport. Now, you guys have seen Newport before, maybe not even close to what it looks like now, but this is Newport. Uh, to the left, we have the Queen Elizabeth II, and I hope that's the right, I'm almost positive it is, but I really do hope I didn't speed that up. Uh, yeah, so this is from by Nico. This was a birthday present for Blib, actually, and it looks really, really great. Um, so that's here. You can come check it out. Also, I put Carnival Fascination here instead of Norwegian Sun. Norwegian Sun used to be here, but, you know, I've sort of more or less decided that Norwegian Sun won't be, you know, continued. So, uh, yeah, Fascination's here for now. I might be doing an interior on here within the future. Within the future. Well, yeah, hopefully. Um, she's looking pretty good. Again, there's no water in this area, so it does look kind of funny, but I can assure you that it looks great with water. Uh, so don't worry about that. We also have some, uh, this is a... Uh, a Marine Defender class Coast Guard ship, which is named the PSCG Manta, which actually isn't PSCG anymore, which is a problem, so that'll need to be fixed. And this is the MV Weathercock. Okay. Um, so, anyway, we're going to go ahead and go north real quick, and I'm going to show you uh, what is new. Um, I really hope they didn't remove my jetty. It should still be here. All right. So this is a big jetty that comes off of where what will be the port, and you'll see in a second. It's just this big kind of extending bit that goes into the bay. Uh, so this will be turn, end up being like a park sort of thing. There'll be a lighthouse down there. It'll be it'll be nice. Um, that should be cool, I think. Uh, it'll be like a place that you can sit and watch the ships as they depart from Newport as well as NSP Harbor, and that is where we're headed now. So uh, you'll you're gonna it's, it's just really started so there's not a ton yet and you can see that's Costa Pacifica it looks like a dog with no ears uh, as you can see it's been clipped she was put in just for size um, as you can see a lot of stuff got clipped in fact I should really should just remove her this side's even worse 
Um, but she was just here kind of for scale. And uh, yeah, she's uh, she's a pretty big ship. And let's look at how much more dock there is once we get past her, because it's pretty crazy. All right, and she's out of view. So uh, yeah, new or NSP Harbor will likely hold a, or close five or six. We're looking at five or six full-size cruise ships. As you can see, this goes, this keeps going, keeps going, keeps going, <laughs> all the way to about here, maybe a little further, and then it's going to come over this way. Because uh, over here, it does, actually, yeah, I can come a lot closer over here. But we'll come closer here, and then we'll go this way, uh, which is north, and there will likely be a last, the last cruise ship will be right there. And then it cuts back over this way. Oh, well, there will be some cargo. Actually, this will probably be the Navy refueling area, this short bit here. Uh, it's not super long or anything. We're just going to have a couple Navy ships docked. Kind of, uh, it's like a sign of power. We'll have a main Navy base in the south part of the new map. Um, actually, this is a lot wider than I thought. Yeah, I think this might actually end up being cargo, and we'll put Navy somewhere else. So this will all be cargo ships. Um, I know we're going to have a rail transport ship. We're going to have a ro roll-on, roll-off ferry along with multiple cargo ships and uh, non-container cargo ships and stuff like that. So there'll be a lot of stuff. And then it'll continue to come. And then so we'll come back south uh, through here. And we'll probably end about here-ish. And again, there will be some Navy ships down towards the end. Now, if I warp to the cruise yard real quick. This is probably the last thing I want to show you. Uh, these are some of the ships I've gathered that are going to go in the port. This is that rail ferry. Uh, we do need to resize the rail because that's actually not correct. Here's some general um, non or non container cargo ships, which are neat. Uh, here are a couple of fictional pilot boat pilot boat designs that I've been working on. Uh, I do like both of those. This is so, sort of the more modern, and this is like an 80s 90s pilot boat. And then this is the Don Mersk. These are all Nikos. This one is that one is that one is that one is and that one and those tugs. So a lot of the stuff is actually Nikos. Um, but he is pretty good at cargo, and so these will all be making it there. Uh, Mer Mersk Wyoming has been getting some updates from me, and she will make it there. Uh, Alabama Mersk, or Mersk Alabama, or Mersk, um, no, Alexander Mersk will probably make it into port. Um, so all these all these ships will, will, and then here is the model. So actually, the airport is sort of in this bit, so where I just showed you, this actually doesn't take into account that little lip. There's actually a bit that sticks out kind of here and I'm using cobwebs and I don't know why. Um, but there's actually like a lip right there. And so, um, yeah, so this last ship will likely end up being like this instead. So as you can see, there will be six ships, which is pretty cool. Uh, but we do have the uh, NSP International Airport is right in the middle of the port area, like in that bit. So we do have to take into account the air traffic for those runways. So we can't have any super tall standing ships uh, directly within the line for that runway. That'll be kind of a hazard, you know, having airplanes on their final approach approaching ships. Yeah, that could end badly. Um, and so we also have air traffic approaching and departing from the west as well as approaching and departing from the north, or approaching to the north, coming from the north, and then approaching approaching to the west, coming from the west, uh, leaving and departing respectively. We will also have parking garages. So this will be the main interstate. And then we'll have uh, three parking garages, one for each uh, terminal, and then each terminal will be for two ships, in theory. We'll have some warehouses in general, kind of like parking areas for you know, all the utility trucks and everything that'll be used to load the ships with um, like food and stuff. And then we also have uh, two hotels, because uh, people that will be flying in, you know, people fly into Miami all the time to go on a cruise, so, you know, you got to take that into consideration. And then here's the rail line coming from that, that rail ferry right there. And then we'll have the row row and a couple others, and then also the Navy down here. I don't know if we'll actually do piers for the Navy, but we'll see. Uh, it's still kind of sketchy. Uh, none of it's really set out. But yeah, there's a lot going on. I haven't actually worked on um, Quantum of the Seas too much recently. I need to. I've been talking with uh, Josh actually recently about starting on that. He's going to give me a hand with the interior along with JGA. Uh, so we should have a pretty good team going. And uh, hopefully we'll start on that within the next few weeks. Um, for those of you that aren't aware, I do sort of have like this jobish thing, internship kind of thing uh, that is going on during the week. So I'm gone most of the day. Um, 
So yeah, that's it's it is kind of difficult actually. Again, it's actually like almost worse than school. Um, so I'm doing a lot of these recordings at night now. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like the video if you liked it and dislike it if you disliked it. Uh, leave a comment down below for suggestions, what I should do, what ships I should build, you know, la 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 la, whatever you want. That's that's cool. Um, I have my Instagram down below, Twitter, which I don't use, uh, Facebook, which I also don't use. Uh, PMC is down there if you want to download some of these ships. I know uh, Carnival Conquest, um, Carnival Fascination. Oh, that's Carnival Conquest 2.0. This Carnival Conquest is up for download. Because Pacifica is. So, yeah, there's lots of stuff on there. So, just be sure to check it out. And I will see you guys in the next video.